everybody, Meriden Gaming here, and we're back in our Minecraft world after finishing our little starter house. And uh, we used three different colors of wood to kind of bring in the woodsy feel we've got here. We're going to use that on our stable that we're going to build. Uh, we're going to build this for sheep, cows, and a horse. And these are 7x7 seven seven for the sheep and the cows, and then a 5x5 five five for the horse because it doesn't need as much space. And yeah let's see and we're going to be using the wood and i've got this little design that i use stairs and slabs to kind of have this side somewhat open to let the light in and that, so you can see your animals no matter where you're at as long as you're close by uh, make sure a wolf hasn't snuck in and ate your sheep because that happens more often than you would think anyway um yeah so seven by seven with five in between same thing here and then, yeah, that should be good enough. And then three by three here. Well, five by five with three by three in the middle. Alrighty. All right. So yeah, we're gonna be using uh, oak and spruce. I can grab that. I think I may need more spruce though. And dirt to build with. Or apples. Oh, and uh, while well, off camera when I was gathering this stuff, I did find a little cave nearby uh, so that we could get some shears to shear the sheep. It was just right over there in that area. And then a bucket for our sugarcane farm that we'll be starting later, although I probably won't get to it this episode. Alright, so eh, it's getting dark. Let's go ahead and go shear the sheep and get us a second bed because uh, when we go out exploring, um, we need to be able, oh, nice, we got three right off the bat, all right, and then we'll just make us a bed real quick, and I don't have any dye, so it'll have to stay white for now, all right, and put it behind there, and sleep, perfect. Let's see. We'll go ahead and split these out. Oh, planks. Um, and I think half of those ought to be good. Grab those. All right, here we go. Break that up. And If I can jump right, three, there we go. As you can see, then we'll just put slats uh, or slabs along here uh, going across, and it will uh, allow light in the sides. Three, okay. And I think we'll do the double color thing like we did over there. We're just switching up the colors. Instead of having the spruce and the dark on the bottom, we'll have the oak on the bottom and then the darker colors on top. Alright, there we go. One, two, three. Um, I guess we'll do this here. You might have to change this because I'm not sure how well it's going to look. With, if I get the angle right, with there being like stairs right next to each other, back and forth. Okay, I don't need more. All right, so that should finish up this. Uh, we'll do this top one first. If I can aim. Come on, there we go. All right, so here, here, here. All right, and then. That, uh, which, uh, you know what? We're probably going to need quite a few planks, so let's go ahead and grab plank. Oh, that's a lot. That's probably way too much. Anyway, here. 
there, 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 and there. Okay, these in place. All right. So as you can see, you can see through them, both from the inside and outside, so you can see your animals, and it lets that light in. It just looks, it's an interesting design that uh, I don't see too often. Because Minecraft's all about adding those little texture details. Although I still need a lot of practice with that, because I, even though I play a lot, I tend to explore more. Uh, okay, so now I want to do a row of blocks here and then fences across the top. Um, let's see, and then let's finish this. All right, there we go. All right, perfect. All right, and then we need these more stairs. Uh, yeah, that should be good. So now we can get the horse portion. Right, cut down. One, two, three. And one, two, three. All right. And then these. And, and I'm not sure if I want to go with that horse. There's a brown one there and a black and gray one over there somewhere. Although I may go with this guy just because he's close. I don't really use horses all that much. I try to get to the end and get my elytra pretty quickly. Just because I like flying rather, it's faster than riding a horse. That's also why we need a sugarcane farm, just so we have enough for fireworks. All right. Let's see. Um, yeah, let's see about these instead. Let's do some strip logs, see what it looks like. Um, yeah, we'll put fences on top. Strip those down. I think I like that. It looks right, right? It looks good. Okay, let's put more right here. Oh, no, wrong angle. There, there, okay. And then, although. I'm not sure if I like this stair there because it creates a weird little gap. Go ahead and do that. Um, do I like that or not? Let's take that out and put another one of these in. It looks okay. Although I don't, I don't know. Let's take out this one too. Let's see what it looks like with that across the back. Grab that there and there. Although I don't like the way that looks, especially on the end log. I don't like the end log. And it looks weird for it to be sitting on top of that. Let's take that out, I think. Yeah. Okay, so I'll take that out. We'll Put a uh, full block. How do we like that? I don't know. I don't know if I like those two textures against each other quite like that. So you got that smooth, and then you got. Yeah, I'm. Just, I'm. I'm not OCD, but at the same time, I'm OCD. You know what I mean? Let's see if we do. Oh. Yeah, no, because that leaves a weird looking gap between them. So no, let's put that up. Oh, no, wrong block. Let's try this again. There. Although I can still see that through the edge. I'm still torn. Because that looks okay, but at the same time, I know from the outside it's going to look weird. Let's go ahead and get rid of that and put the stair. But then you've got the gap. I'm not. What about if we move these back, maybe? 
and then put the fence on. Oh, of course, we're going to break our thing. This takes way too long trying to do it with without an axe. We put that there. Put out. Oh, I need my. Yep. And then this and this. How's that look? It's got a little bit more room for them to graze. But I don't know if I like this because then I'll have to make it too wide. And let me. Do I have any? No, I don't have any cobblestone. Let me go get some cobblestone and then we'll get another axe. I don't think I like how it sticks out in the back. Ooh, wheat. Let's grab this. Um, and we need seeds. Make sure not to mess up the ground. And these three. Sorry. Yeah, I've got a. I get distracted easily. All right. And then where's my cobblestone? Nope. 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 No. There we go. Okay, so we need three. And let's make us an axe. And here we go. Axe. We'll move those over here. Put the seeds up. And there. Alright. Let's get back to work on this. Um, I think I'm just going to take that out and put in the full block because I don't like the gap especially when from the side it would look funky to have that one little quarter piece of there's another glitch in the video let's take those out I've got a fairly robust computer but it still does the weird little glitch video glitch every once in a while I think that's gonna work ooh we've got a sheep already in here I think I like that yeah Okay, uh, let's, um, we're going to use spruce for fences. Let's grab some of these fences and see if we can get him captured in here real quick. Before, let's see, 20, and, yeah, 12 will be good for now. And then we'll put that there, grab those, put that there. Okay, and let's see if we can get him caught inside of here. So that's one less we have. To, oh, he already left. Okay. Um, let's go ahead and sleep. Sleep. Oh, we got a few minutes. Okay. Um, yeah, I think I like the block, even though I don't like the two color texture. I think I like that better than having the gap like we have here. So, new axe. And there we go. And take those out. And nope. Strip block, okay, and then full block, full block, full block, okay. I think I like that, and now we can sleep. Hopefully, something doesn't spawn and kill us while we're sleeping. I have had that happen. There's someone downside of sleeping outside, and we'll put these here. Leave a cap in the middle in case we need to lead him through, so he can just jump over, and then here, 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 and gate. Except that fences don't attach to stairs. So yeah, we'll take these out, put in full blocks. It won't. It'll still look fine because it, it'll have the same thickness as the other side. So yeah, let's do the same thing here. And there we go. Okay, there we go. And then we'll need to do the same. Thing here and pull, pull, and we need more oak. Uh, oak, and we need to fill in that back there. So let me do that real quick first. Our oh, still had oak. Okay, let's do this first. So then we've got all of our Oak out of the way, or our logs out of the way, and now I just need to break down some more. So, yeah, okay. Um, let's see, we need these three, like that, okay, and 
and then these three. There, there, and there. And then these. Right here. Okay, and one there. And put our fences in. We can lead them through the front since we can ride a horse in and we'll put that. Let's see, make sure we got enough for. Oh, no, I'm going to need more uh, spruce. Alright, let's see, we need nine, I think I just counted. Um, we need more sticks though first. So that is no sticks. There we go. And then do that. One, two, three. I think it's nine. And then need another gate. That there. There we go. Start with that. Touch that. And there we go. Okay. Now we should have enough. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, gate, gate, two. All right. Except I'm still going to need more. And I better fix that. Okay. Um, we'll take these out. I'm still going to need two more spruce fences, though. Because we have to fill those gaps in the back. Okay. So there we go. That looks good. Oh, it work. Yep. Okay. So now we need to move on to the roof. And I'm going to need more spruce. Let's get rid of all the stuff we don't need. And we will also need some dark oak. Let's see how that looks. I think it looks okay. Right? And then we got to figure out, we got two wide there, or two heights, and then, yeah, so we need slabs. And then we need stairs. And yeah. Actually, we're running a lot of stairs. All right. And then we'll just collect the rest of that. Okay. And um, dark oak? Or do we want regular oak? So we can do the lighter on the bottom and then the two darker colors, kind of like that same pattern on the bottom, I'm thinking. Yeah. Grab that. Um, that. Let's see what it looks like with just two colors, because it's a simple, a more simple design rather than Quite as complicated with the all the patterns of the other so there um there and i'm gonna have to move and we gotta get the right angle okay and we'll come across so we have that small little slope up like the other roof i don't know if i can get that um Fill her up and then here and carefully right there. Okay. And that and then we need to put this too. And then we need to put these along the edge. There we go. Alright, and um yeah, we'll fill it up. Okay, that's not where I was aiming, but that works. And let's see, we'll do spruce, stair, stair. And I think that's high enough. This isn't going to be as tall of a roof as the starter house. So let's see, one, two, three, four to the middle. And then let's see, one two, three, and then we'll go around and go here. Oh, 
I didn't jump. If I had jumped, I could have made that. I don't. Yeah, I can't jump on top of fences. That's not. We're not in modded. In modded, you can get certain little trinkets or whatever that make you jump higher. So, um, yeah. Let's see. Stair, stair, and then we do a stair this way, here, and stair there. Okay, so now we should be in the middle, and let's go ahead and give this a little bit more of a slope. One, two, one, two, and one more there. Let's see how that looks. And where's my shovel? There we go. Okay. Let's back off and see. Do we like that? I think I like it. I mean, it's it's basic, but we're going for a basic look for right now. And we have to figure out what we're going to do here in the center for lighting and whatnot. Um, where? Okay, we have Mr. Orsi. So now we need to take the rest of these and get some more slabs because we need quite a few to go through the center. Um, let's see, how do we want to do this? Um, you know what, there we go. And stair, oh, ah, fell off. Um, you know what, let's just do a staircase right here and now we can do this. Okay, jump and place and carefully place and again if I can click. I hate trying to get that just that right angle. This mouse is super sensitive, so you barely move it and it goes like flying across the screen. Um okay, let's try this again and then let's see. Do we want to do two wide like we did on the house? Although I only did one high where the two met, or one wide. Let's do one wide for now. Stair, and then backwards stair, or upside down. And then we do these slabs, right? I think, yeah. All right, one, two, three, four, Seven. And then let's jump this if I can make it. And we did. I normally miss jumps like that. So one, two, and three. So now we just got to go to the middle with our planks. And we'll just do the top level. And here. And, ah! Yeah, that was great. Someone doesn't have very good spatial. And again, I don't have good spatial awareness apparently, and I fall off of stuff. I can trip falling down, or trip standing up. Ha! <laughs> yeah, trip falling down. So you're already tripping, but you trip again. Okay, so um, um, wait. One, two. Okay, I need one more here, right? There we go. OCD kicking in. Right, there we go. Across here. And perfect. And I think we'll leave a gap in the middle or between the two and do a different color. Kind of break up from the inside. You can see a couple different stripes. And we'll do this one. Alrighty. Perfect. Okay. And then we'll do. I think I want to do dark oak. We could do regular oak. That might be a lot of regular oak. Sleep. All right. Respawn point set. That was probably from earlier. All right. So we got to figure out what we want to do in the center, and then for the lighting, and we got to got to figure out what we want to do over here too. Um. Let's see. Let's go ahead and hop over. Let's place this right here. And then I think I just want to go up one here and then probably a slab on top right there in the middle. Ow. No spatial awareness. Let's get these apples because we need to eat. 
And then we need to get more spruce. I put some spruce over here just so we don't have to go across the river all the time. Right there. I like having all my different types of wood close by. So let's go ahead and grab this. Alright, our new axe. And ah, uh, that's too high. Jump, 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 hop, hop, hop. Come on. You can get it. There we go. And it fell down through the center. Perfect. Alright, so let's break these leaves. And go ahead and get rid of those. And we'll keep that one below us so we don't have to jump. Oh, never mind. Didn't have to. Okay, break through those. I've got five trees over here so we can get a decent amount of spruce. It's usually yeah, like, I don't know, 20 or 30. Um, okay, let's go ahead and replant while we're here so we have more. Okay, uh, oh, oh, didn't grow. We're going to get this. There, there. Yeah, and perfect. All right. Um, oh, let's grab these other saplings and go ahead and go in there and there. If you hadn't noticed, I tend to space them out exactly the right amount, and this one grew. Um, you need a minimum, I think, of three for them to grow naturally, or I just like spacing them out evenly, and I can't reach that. Okay, let's put some dirt down. And that. Oh, I didn't fall. Where'd it go? Here? Nope. Here? Nope. Here? Nope. Here. And of course it's gonna fall. Oh no, that was a sapling. Oh, I think I heard it. Okay. Did we get it? Okay. And we'll put a sapling here. And one here. And hop. Oh, come on. Why am I stuck? Oh. Oops, here is that. Okay. Um, so we'll put one right here. So one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Yep. Right there. Grab that. And that's probably good enough for now. We can always plant more later. All right, let's go over here and get our dark oak as well. It's right here in the middle chest. Oh, we got that, that, uh, actually everything. Okay, and close the door. And let's see what we can do about the rest of this roof. And we need to drop off stuff we don't need. Uh, actually, I need the apple. Um, yeah, put the apple back in. Oh, apparently I'm just close enough to open the gate. Okay, um, so... Dark up here? I think maybe... Oh, although, I need to remove those so I can put this, the ones on top of it in place first. Alright, let's see. Um... Uh, can I get the right angle on this? I don't know if I can. Is that? No. Okay. Um. Well. Let's try this again. Here we go. There. There. Oh. Graphics glitch. Uh, okay. One, two, three. Okay. So then. And. Yeah, we'll put some here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right. And then, oh, I need to do that one as well. So, here, here, yeah, there we go. There, 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 and, right, oh, that doesn't look right, right. That one. Yeah, there we go. Okay, and then we need it on this side. So here. Oh. Uh, if we put one here, it'll even it. 
thought they would have straightened it out. They do some weird things. And of course it's going to land on top. I'll have to get that in a minute. Okay, so there, 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 and right here. Okay. So now we need the planks or the slabs to go in the middle. Here, 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 and here. And same thing here. I am building on the fly. I tend to build on the fly more than I do. Like I have a general idea in my head and then I just try to um let's see any more dark oak slabs. Is that that should be enough for slabs. And then we need some stairs. Um let's see no oh, we need more than that. Um I think twelve more ought to be enough. Alright, okay. Um yeah, I build on the fly, like I get a general idea in my head. I tend to do like I said in the last episode, I tend to find actual like real pictures of structures and then build them from uh, or uh, do a whatever you call it. I use that for inspiration to get the actual design. Like I like I said, I did the Great Lighthouse of Alexandria by looking at multiple different drawings and pictures of what they believed it would have looked like, and then copied it over. All right, now we got to do this. Um, let's see. So we need here. go. Alright, and then the last few dark oak right here. And grab that. Okay. Now we gotta finish this. So we need spruce. Except I need to break down the spruce. Okay. So spruce. Break it all down. And then we need some stairs. One, two, three. That ought to be good. Ah, didn't mean to do that. I'm gonna do this. And some of those. Okay. And there we go. Okay. And what was I talking about? I don't remember. Yeah. Okay. Um so let's get rid of that because we're gonna need a full block here, I think. Or I could do I could do dark oak. Uh, no, no, we need to link this. Okay, so full, and then stair, right? I think stair, and then slab. Yeah, slab. there we go. Now we got the little rise in the middle too. I think I like the look at that. Although I need a slab coming off that, right? For it to look right, like right here, don't I? Although I don't know if that's going to look right. Because I've got a slab here coming off the edge to make it wider. Because you want it to overlap the edge where, you know, because that's how a normal house does it. But then I've got that stair there. Um, that's a look. I don't know if I like that. Why can't I jump? There we go. Um, because technically I need one here too, right? And then this needs to come out, one to overhang, and oh, I'm not sure if I can get this. All right, let's try this again. Okay, so stair. Um, what do you think? We take that out and put a full block, and do a stair here. So full and stair, right? Yeah, and then slab, slab. Okay. So now that looks the same as that. Okay. Um, and then slab, 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 
slab, and then slab. So now we're out as far as that, and then we need a stair, a stair, um, a stair, slab, or no, it's slabs, yeah. And let's go back down here because we need more. And sleep. All right, and um, yeah, Let's see how this looks. I don't know if I like the overhang on this part of the roof right here. I think I'm gonna need to take that off because, like, that continues the, the edge of the roof line, so it won't be off. So the overhang is actually on this edge here. I think that looks okay. Right? Or do I take that out? I don't think that's going to look right because then it just comes to the edge of the pillar and looks funky because you need overhangs whenever you're doing houses or buildings because that's how most buildings have is an overhang. I think that's what I want. Right? Um. Yeah. Uh, okay. Except I can't get up there anymore. Alright. Alright. So let's just go ahead and make us a very staircase so we can get up and down. And I think I like that little arch there, so that'll work. Okay. Let's finish off this side here. So we need to take this one. Oh. That one, we're just gonna fall. That one, and we will put that there. And then we need stairs. And then we fill in with slabs there. Okay. Now we've got that. And then we need to put dark oak here. And then here. Perfect. All right, and then we need uh, a stair there. Or slabs. No, slabs work. Yeah. Um, except I need to put these up top. Oh, dang it. Try it again. One more time. There we go. Okay, so there we go. And then... What do we want to do here? Do we want to do four blocks of spruce or dark oak to link the two roofs? Let's see, what do we got under here? Oh, uh, yeah, there's a gap there in there. Okay, um, slabs or full? I think full. That way it will look right from beneath. How's that look? I think it looks good, don't you? Just gotta figure out what we're gonna do here in the middle. Um, let's grab. No, no, gotta get rid of the. Where's my shovel? Yep, so I grab my shovel after I equip it. Gotta get rid of those. Alright. And then grab that and that. Okay. And close. Alrighty, so I think that looks good. We gotta figure out what we're gonna do here for the pillars and then the lighting because it will get too dark in here and stuff will spawn and kill our well they wouldn't necessarily kill our sheep but they might kill them trying to attack us so we need more oak get rid of the dark and what do you think um oak and we need our dirt okay so there and there okay and let's put a there and there. And I don't think I need one there, right? I think it looks okay. You're not going to be able to tell. That should be fine. And then where do we want to put our slabs is going to be the question. Um, the ceiling. Okay, so do we want to have it to where it's got the same, like right here, and come across the slabs? Or. 
higher. Or we could do full blocks here coming across like a beam. Yeah, let's do that. So beam here. There you go. And then let's see. What are we going to do? Oh, was that a Enderman? Oh, it is. Don't look at him. Don't look at him. Um, how do I do this? Uh, that's on the bottom half, so I could put one here and here, and then put a torch here and here for now. We need to get some, like, redstone lamps or something. Uh, of course, that's way on down the road. We haven't even been to the nether yet. Um, let's see what our light level is. We are at 11. It has to be below 7, or at 7 or below for mobs to spawn so that's good and here in the middle we're at 10 so that ought to be okay um, and then we have to figure out how we're going to do that side because we can't do one in the middle because the roof is so low there um, and I can't do one here at least not I, I don't have a way to do one here what about in the in the floor maybe like if I had some carpet, I could put a torch down and carpet over it, uh, right? Yeah, we'll go with that. Uh, I need my shears. Where? Are I? Oh, there we go. Did it? <sighs> yeah, meant to do that. Okay. Um, here, sheepy, sheepy, sheepy. I just want your wool. I promise it won't hurt much. And there we go. Okay, so two of that. And now we got carpet. I like using carpet. I don't see a lot of people that use carpet. So, of course, I I haven't really experimented much with, like, the terracotta and stuff like that. So we'll have to definitely get into that later. So, okay, so break that one and this one. And I need to get that dirt block. Come on. There we go. Okay, dirt block. We put a torch here. Dirt block, dirt block, and then on the side of this one we can put it right, right here. Why is it not placing? It can place there. Oh, can you not place it? They must have changed it. Like you used to be able to place it on the side of a block. Although that was with only water below it and. Because I would use it to cover up, like, for my sugarcane farm. So I should be able to place it there. Okay. So that'll work. I need to dye this green. Like, this color green, or, like, a, either a dark green or a lime green. Um, there is two colors of green, right? Um, okay, so light level looks good here. It's in the... If you hit F3, it's on the left side about halfway down. So... 13 because of the sun here. We're 10 in the middle. In the middle is going to be fine. Let's go check this side. Um, so 12, 12. Yeah, we look good here because these are like transparent or not full blocks, so light comes through them. And yeah, I think that looks good. It looks, you know, similar design to our starter house, but you can still see your. Uh, animals through the side of it. So yeah, I think I like it. Let me have a look at the back side. Anyway, uh, it's Mirrodin Gaming. I hope you enjoyed this little tutorial and or part of our series. Uh, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And um, I'll see you on the plains. Right? Plains? Or are we in a forest? I think we're technically on the edge of the forest, so we're in the plane still. Anyway, yeah. Later.